What is up, winning guys? I do work with Charles, your boy, and I'm back again. So it's a beautiful day, and I think I'm going to buy myself this shoe for Christmas. I have to. Now, it's been a very rare occasion to get some very nice Jordan 1 highs, and today we've got one example, which is beautiful, and also I'm in need of some new Jordan 1 highs. So I will show you guys in a couple of seconds, but before I get there, let me just prompt you guys, if you haven't, please make sure you subscribe, and also guys, make sure you like this video so it can go up the algorithm and let's go, guys. So without any further ado, let me just introduce you to the shoe. And bam, it's the Air Jordan 1 High OG. They're called the George Green. They've probably got another name as well. Check it on StockX. So these are coming out on the 26th. They're coming out on sneakers. They'll be £165. For the retail price, I think we sell wise we're talking about at least the 200s, you know, in the £200 region, there, thereabouts. Do not sleep on the shoe. This shoe is going to go up in value. Absolutely. Listen to me. Do not sleep on this shoe. It's going to go up in value. I think the Jordan 4s, as well as these shoes so far, say in the last maybe, say, three months, are I think probably one of the best shoes for men that have come out from the Jordan brand. We've not seen that much shoes, you know, uh, this summertime with exception to the Travis Scott Jordan 1 lows and highs. We've not seen anything. I think that's kind of got the blood pumping again. This reminds me of 2019, 2018, you know, getting this type of shoe, which is neat, beautiful, and you know it's going to be so. And the vibe is only going to go up. So this is a money maker. November 26, guys, this is a money maker. Get your money ready and just go, man. It's a beautiful shoe. I like it. I'm going to cop a personal pair. For Christmas time, I deserve it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't care for buy resell. I will buy resell if I have to. These will go up in value. So what do we have here, guys? So we'll start with the swoosh this time. So you've got this aluminium, but it's like a shiny aluminium swoosh, which is beautiful, lovely. It goes with that green as well. The green is not bright. It's that like very rich green, which is subtle in a way. And then you've got the white, which is obviously, you know, a given match to the green. Then the silver as well as, you know, or the aluminium is just a light color, which blends in with everything else as well. Simple. It works. I love it. I love it. I love it. So the tongue comes in that white with the green tags at the top. You got the green shoelaces to match. I think the green laces do the job, honestly. I wouldn't suggest that you do change them. So you've also got the wing logo that comes in that lovely pattern as well. As I go back to look at it closely, so it comes in white as well as that gray as well. So in terms of what you can wear with a shoe, it's easy. All you've got to do is wear some cargo pants that are black. Get yourself a varsity jacket that is black and green. Could be white and green if you want to, but I don't like, you know, white clothes that much because they get dirty. And you can wear with that as well and maybe incorporate like a white beanie head, but good luck trying to keep that clean. And I'll probably head towards maybe a black beanie. And then just wear the shoes. I think that'll be a nice vibe. You can also do it like in a different way. You can wear, if you're one of those that can keep white stuff clean, you can wear like an all white tracksuit set, whether from Jordan or any other brand. And then you can wear this with maybe like a white beanie hat as well. You don't have to wear a beanie hat as well. It's entirely up to you. Or either you can wear some jeans as well. Not many people wear jeans nowadays, let's be honest. So you can wear some jeans, uh, some probably like some, you know, light blue, some washed, some blue washed denim jeans. I wouldn't suggest you wear some ripped ones because it's cold out here. And then wear like a white top or something like that, you know. And there's just endless, I think, outfit ideas, which you should, you guys shouldn't struggle with. Come on, man. So, yeah. So, resale-wise, these would definitely go up, guys. Now, be careful, obviously. Don't be buying stupid prizes like... Sorry, don't be buying stupid sizes like size 12, size 13s. Those are obviously high risk. But I think half sizes should be very profitable over time because some parents tend to buy shoes that are a little bit smaller so that children can grow into that shoe. If you've got a father that was, you know, into Jordans, this is a perfect... Christmas present so you can get them boyfriend or your girlfriend or wife or whatever you can still buy them this is a perfect shoe and also they can keep the shoe locked away because for me personally I wouldn't wear this shoe until summertime 
Yeah, maybe they might wear it, like maybe if I've got like a green. Well, actually, I've got a blue puffer jacket, so it's a light blue. I can actually make it work with probably some some blue jeans as well, and then put them on as well. That I think that can that can go. It's not the best, but it is what it is. But yeah, otherwise, I think I'll probably say summertime, get the Boston Celtic, you know, tops, and just, yeah, just go ahead. Guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this video. If you've got any comments or if you've got any questions, comment down below. Better yet, guys, follow my Instagram, which I'll leave the link for in the description box. Our God bless. Peace out.